I think winners are forever. If you have a winning stock, hold on to it forever. And a lot of people make the mistake of thinking they've got to take a gain. You know, I bought Apple at 400, I'm going to sell it at 600, I'm smart. No, that's not smart. That's dumb. What's up, YouTube? I have a great video for you today with a little help from my AI assistant, and it's called... How to invest like Warren Buffett, eToro Warren Buffett CF Smart Portfolio. Like and subscribe or the dog gets it. The smart thing is to hang on to winners and sell off your losers. Listen to Warren Buffett. Warren Buffett was smart about this, and he said things like, the best holding period is forever. Of course, his stocks only go up. And he's also been known to say things like, I got richest fastest by sitting on my butt. And the reason is he doesn't like to share his gains with a tax collector either. We're quite content to sit with, to sit with our best holdings. People have tried to do that with Berkshire uh, over the years. I've, I've had some friends that thought it was getting a little ahead of itself from time to time, and they thought they'd sell and buy it back cheaper and everything. It's pretty tough to do. You have to make two decisions right. You know, you have to buy it, you have to sell it right first, and then you have to buy it right later on, and usually you have to pay some tax in between. It, to get into a wonderful business, the best thing to do is to, usually is to stick with it. First, let's go through some of Warren Buffett's trading strategies and philosophy. Warren Buffett invests in great businesses trading for less than their intrinsic values, and then he holds on to these investments for as long as they remain great businesses. Here are Warren Buffett's investing philosophy in eight steps. 1. Look for a margin of safety. For example, if a stock trades for $10 per share, but that company's assets are realistically worth $12 per share, then there's a $2 margin of safety. The intrinsic value of the assets should prevent the company's stock price from declining too significantly. 2. Focus on quality. Warren Buffett doesn't invest in junk. Quote, it's far better to buy a wonderful company at a fair price than a fair company at a wonderful price. 3. Don't follow the crowd. Here's another piece of Buffett advice that is extremely important for beginner investors, especially in the modern age of Reddit message boards. Don't buy certain stocks just because everyone else is, but also do not aim to always be against the crowd and sell the stocks that everyone else is buying, as the price will go up. 4. Don't fear market crashes and corrections. Buffett loves it when stock prices drop since it creates opportunities to buy at a discount. If you were shopping at your favorite store and suddenly learned that the entire store's prices were 20% lower, would you panic and run away? Of course not. Buffett embraces discounts on his favorite stocks and says, opportunities come infrequently. When it rains gold, put out the bucket, not the thimble. 5. Approach your investments with a long-term mindset. One of the most important Warren Buffett quotes on investing you can absorb is, if you aren't willing to own a stock for 10 years, don't even think about owning it for 10 minutes. 6. Don't be afraid to sell if the scenario changes. A famous Warren Buffett quote from when he was asked about an investment, he decided to sell at a loss is the most important thing to do if you find yourself in a hole is to stop digging. 7. Learn the basics of value investing. Warren Buffett is widely considered to be the world's greatest value investor. Value investing prioritizes paying low prices for investments relative to their intrinsic values. 8. Research and reflect. Buffett regularly spends long days in his office in Omaha, Nebraska. But it often surprises investors to learn that he spends the majority of his time just sitting alone and reading or not doing anything at all. As he has been quoted as saying, I insist on a lot of time being spent, almost every day, to just sit and think. The Warren Buffett CF copy portfolio consists of stocks in which Berkshire Hathaway, Buffett's holding company, are invested according to the latest SEC filings provided by tip ranks. The portfolio offers exposure to a broad range of sectors, including technology, health and finance, among others. Please note, the rebalancing of this portfolio is performed on a quarterly basis by the portfolio manager of eToro. The weights of the assets may change at any time by eToro at the sole discretion of the portfolio manager. Over to you, Enda. Thank you, AI lady. Now let's look at the stats of the Warren Buffett CF portfolio force. So we just come down here to his performance. So this is copying exactly what Warren Buffett is doing in his portfolio. But remember guys that Warren Buffett only releases 
his stats on what he is buying and what he is selling every three months and this portfolio is going to be rebalanced every four months so you're going to have a little bit of time before that information is released and the portfolio is updated but you can see here now this year he's down minus 2.26 percent which is not too bad compared to a lot of other popular investors etc are way down at the moment the markets are way down now last year he was 28 percent up 18 percent up 33 percent in the 2019 then minus 14.4 in 2018 and then 11%, 11.3% in 2017. Now, if you look down here, the risk score is really nice for this portfolio. It's averaged around four for most of the time, but then with all of the volatility in the market at the moment, it's popped up to five there. Max drawdowns are really good. So the daily is minus 3.34, weekly is minus 5.54 and yearly is minus 11.49 which is really good um, okay there's 3296 investors copying this portfolio with their own money and there's over 5 million in management now 26 new investors in the last seven days now Warren Buffett is famous for being a value investor but growth stocks have been doing much better since 2014 as you can see here this year he is beating the s p 500 index you can see it's down minus 6.04 and he's only down minus 2.26 so are the tides torn in for warren buffett now last year 2021 he he had a return of 28.06 and the return of the s p 500 was 30.92 so the s p 500 beat him slightly last year same again for the the year before nearly equal on 2020 18.18 and s p was 18.14 and you can see here now he beat the S&P 500 on 2019 at 33.5% and the S&P 500 was 31.49. Now in the 90s Warren Buffett was famous for beating the S&P 500 index. But has things changed for him over the last decade? But are things changing for him in the next coming years? We'll have to see. But you can pause the screen there and look at this yourself at past performance. Now, looking at the current portfolio, you can see that Apple is a massive percentage of this portfolio. It's 47.6 is. Now, Warren Buffett is not a big believer in diversification. And he said, diversification is protection against ignorance. It makes little sense if you know what you're doing. Meaning, if you know what you're doing, you pick the correct stocks, you don't have to diversify as much. So you can see a large proportion of the portfolio is in Apple, which is a great company. Now we have some of the stable companies like Bank of America, American Express. Of course, Coca-Cola is going nowhere with 7% there. The Kraft Heinz company going nowhere. Food companies are there forever. Okay, now some may say that some of these brick and mortar companies and banking is moving online and to Bitcoin, etc. And this could be a worry for the future, but I can't see that happening anytime soon. But you can see here, you have GM, General Motors, Chevron, all these car companies, and they're going to get into electric cars and etc. for the future. And you have Visa, MasterCard all of these big companies t-mobile so a lot of good safe companies there and he believes in these companies now if you want to copy warren buffett's trades you need to sign up for etro so please use my link in the description it's my affiliate link and to support my work for free and remember no good deed goes unrewarded now for the exciting part guys if you want to copy warren buffett 
CF Smart Portfolio on eToro is very easy. You just come up here and you click invest. Now the minimum to invest is $500. So you just change that to 500 or whatever you want to invest. Now you can set your stop loss here, set to 25. So this means that if it drops in value of 475, it will sell off all the assets. But you can set that to, to whatever you wish. If you want to sell it to the 50% you can put in 250 there and you can see the ratio there stop loss at 50% you just click invest and now we have started investing remember there's going to be them slight spread fees on each zero between the buy and sell price but there's no commission on stocks which is a great thing about eToro so you can just come to your portfolio as you can see here i have it here warren buffett cf smart portfolio and it's already started buying the stocks for me okay you can see there you can click view all there there's all the stocks there now at the moment guys and you can see it's buying all these stocks for me look at it. this is instant coca-cola it's buying that there wow look at i've already copied exactly what was in his portfolio and the same percentage amount but now the prices are going to be different than his because he bought his four months ago on the portfolio but you can see there it's so cool guys so easy to invest now what you can do is you can increase your investment you can pause this you can change your stop loss easily or you can close the investment okay and you can do look at the charts and stuff like if you want to add in funds every month let's say you can just increase your funds let's say i want to add in an extra 200 every month you can just click update or oh, the minimum to add is 250 so well, let's add in 250 so let's say you want to add in every 250 every so often and that's added in there now and that's going to be split between all of these trades okay and that's going to going to be invested with all these these trades here and then the stop loss will be updated to go to 50 percent etc so there we go and how do you close it if you want to take your profit you would just come in here and you would click close investment and that's all you have to do and you click stop investment here and it will start selling off all the stocks you can see there it's at 0.52 percent in the red because of the spread fees but there i've invested 750 that's how easy it is guys if you have any questions at all please leave a comment and thank you very much for watching peace and love and the trading